so we love reviewing e.l.f. products, as you guys it's know. It's kind of an obsession. It is. Yeah. We even want to sign up for the Elf. Oh no, that's the NYX one. NYX and Elf are our. Oh no, Elf has it too. They have a subscription package. I think we're going to sign up for it. Yeah. Um, eyelid primers. We've actually never reviewed any this eyelid primers. By Elf. And it basically sets eyeshadow for a long lasting color. Um, My eyeshadow never lasts. I know it's because I have oily skin, but I feel like no one's eyeshadow lasts all day long. I don't have Everyone oily skin. Creases. Yeah, I don't have oily skin, and I have to, have to, have to wear uh, an eyelid primer. I currently use Too Faced. You use Urban Decay. Urban Decay. Because <laughs> that's the one I use too. And I'm happy with that. I used to use MAC, um, but I mean, Elf. I used to use the MAC Paint Pot as a primer and that didn't work for me. Urban Decay so far has been the only one that works. So I'd be curious to see if e.l.f. Let's see how much we paid for Works it. because this was like, I bet, so cheap. And the Urban Decay one is like- Expensive. It's really expensive. It's definitely in the 20s. I'm gonna tell you guys. Nora's obsessed with this app where she just like <laughs> scans things and it tells her how much it is. Um, $4 guys, $3.99. All right. Not bad. Yeah. So the one I have is Pearl. It's new. And mine is Sheer, which mm. is Sheer. <laughs> um, I'm excited to try these out. We're, so we're gonna put it on. We're gonna do our makeup. And then go out into town like, hey, I'm wearing Look elf. At my and then uh, about midnight, we'll do a follow up video to let you guys know if we have any more eyeshadow or it's just like this after a few drinks. And I'll, then, be, I'll be really excited if it works. Yeah. All right, so let's do our makeup. I like the applicator because my current Urban Decay one, you have to kind of just squeeze it out of a tube and apply it. Which has gotten me used to using a brush to even it out. So I always put my foundation on first and bake. But Ani usually applies her eye makeup first. There is no right or wrong way. I just prefer to do my base before I start with my eyeshadow. So I'm gonna start with the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer in sheer color, which is basically like skin tone, skin color. And I know Ani already mentioned how it's awesome because there's an applicator because the current one I use, the um, Urban Decay one, doesn't have one and I have to go with my fingers all the time. This you can just apply with a brush. And then just spread it. Spread it. Spread it. It's a little white, but I don't mind that because I actually do lighter eyeshadow. So I'm gonna let that dry for a second and put my eyeshadow on. What do you think so far? Um, I really like the applicator, so I like the way that it goes on. I'd be curious to see if it goes on all day because that's gonna be the deciding factor of whether I really like it or not. I agree. I like the fact that it comes with a basically built-in brush. Like a wand, yeah. And you know what I like is that it's not sticky. You know, sometimes it's, uh, especially the Urban Decay one, I apply it and it's like, it's, it's sticky and I get scared. Hmm. So I, I always apply extra eyeshadow. This is really, really light. The only thing is this pearl color um, is a little white. So if you're doing really like light eyeshadow, I guess it's, it's fine. Um, but I would was most fine. likely go with the sheer next time. So I'd be curious to see how long it lasts. Yeah. Stay, Stay tuned. tuned. Hey guys, so it's been a few hours and I removed my lipstick. I'm about to wash my face, but I wanted to show you guys uh, the final result of my eye primer and how it's lasted all night. So it's been about five hours since I used the e.l.f. primer and I still have increased. You can see that. I'm just wearing shimmery eyeshadow. And my eyeshadow is still on, as you can see. No creasing. <laughs> I know I look weird, but. I just want you guys to see. Um, I'm actually really impressed, especially since it was under $4 and I usually pay 20 something dollars for the Urban Decay one. This is an awesome, awesome buy. If it has increased on me, it's probably gonna last a million years on everyone else. Hope you guys enjoyed this product. It's freaking awesome. So definitely two thumbs up on my behalf. Thanks for watching guys. Make sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking here and check out this review we did on the Becca primer and the e.l.f. color correcting primers.